right? Uh, review muna tayo ulit sa steps in long division. Okay? So, alam na natin na una muna is dad. Okay? So, tatandaan lang natin ang members of the family. You have dad. And that is ay para sa pagde-divide. So, dad for divide. Okay? And then, we have mom for multiply. And then, we have sister for subtraction. Uh, brother for bring down. Okay? And rover for repeat or remainder. So, ito lang yung mga steps na yun na tatandaan natin sa long division and di natin mahirapan sa division in decimals. Alright? So, alright? So, subukan muna natin ang, okay, 512 divided by 4. So, review muna natin, ha? And then, review natin yung steps in uh, division. So, we have here, first one again is divide, okay, for dad. And then, multiply for mom, sister for uh, subtraction, uh, brother for bringing down, and then rover for repeat. So, start tayo with 5. 5 divided by 4, that is 1. So, sinundan ko lang ha, divide muna. And then, we have mom, multiply na. So, 1 times 4, that is 4. And then, subtract, 5 minus 4, that is 1. Bring down 1. So, repeat tayo. So, that would be 11 divided by 4. That is 2. And then, multiply 2 times 4. That is 8. And then, subtract 11 minus 8. That is 3. And then, bring down 2. And then, repeat. Okay. So, 32 divided by 4. That is 8. 8 times 4. That is 32. And then, subtract na tayo. We have 32 minus 32. That would be 0. And then, supposed to be, bring down muna. Okay? Kaya lang, wala nang kasunod. So, ang sagot natin ngayon is 128. So, tapos na yan. Right? So, let's go ahead and um, have the vision of decimals. So, Start tayo with dividing a decimal by a whole number. So, we have 20.8 or 20 and 8 tenths divided by 4. So, sundan natin ulit ang um, steps in division ha. So, diretsyo na ako. So, 20, dito tayo magsimula sa 20, divided by 4, that is 5. 5 times 4, that is 20. And then, 20 minus 20, that is 0 and then bring down 8 and then 8 divided by 4 that is 2 2 times 4 that is 8 and then 8 minus 8 that is 0 supposed to be bring down ulit diba kaya lang wala na eh so tapos na tayo pero since we are doing uh, decimals okay so dapat yung decimal dito iakyat natin sa taas so pwede rin na uh, pag sinulat mo na ito okay um, iakyat mo na yan doon para uh, hindi mo makalimutan okay and um di ka na magkakamali. Okay? Dapat lang na ilagay yung decimal point. Sa taas lang din, uh, iakit lang yan. Okay? Magkahanay yung siya sa decimal dito sa uh, dividend. Okay? So, answer natin is 5.2. Let's have another one. Right? So, we have 11.4 divided by 3. So, this is still a decimal. Um, kung tutuosin, this is mixed decimal kasi may whole number dito and then decimal dito. So, mixed decimal divided by a whole number. So, simula tayo with 11. So, kasi hindi kulang yung 1 eh. So, diretso tayo sa 11. So, 11 divided by 3, that is 3. And then, 3 times 3, that is 9. And then, 11 minus 9, that is 2. And then, bring down 4. And then, 24 divided by 3, that is 8. 8 times 3, that is 
24 and then 24 minus 24 that is 0 no and then diretso na tayo with the decimal point sulat na natin okay now kung tatandaan yung steps natin we have dad mom sister brother over diba so ang ginawa ko lang is uh, divide multiply subtract so dad mom sister and then brother and then um repeat and then divide ulit multiply subtract okay and then supposed to be brother na so sinundan ko lang so wag lang kalimutan na uh, may pattern na siya pa ganun ka ganun right ganun lang okay para hindi para hindi mawala okay next we have 4.5 divided by 5. So, still decimal divided by a whole number. Okay? Ang kaibahan lang dito, okay, um, ang sabi ko noon, kung ang unang number ay hindi ka siya sa, sun sa, sa divisor mo, diretso ka na sa sunod, di ba? Kaya lang may point siya dito. May decimal point siya. So, hindi po ito pareha sa iba okay since ito lang ang des, ang ang whole number niya at may decimal point na dito dapat ka nang magsagot dito kasi iba yung whole number iba yung decimals kaya dapat may sagot ka na dito so ibig sabihin lang wala ka nang whole number zero siya kasi hindi umabot ang 4 so lagyan natin ng sagot chan so 0 times uh, 5 that would be 0 and then minus na tayo so 4 minus 0 that is 4 bring down 5 then 45 divided by 5 that is 9 and then 9 times 5 is 45 then 45 minus 45 that is 0 and then akit natin yung decimal point doon okay yan so ito lang na iba kasi kailangan mong magsagot na dito dahil may decimal point na siya sa gilid so ibig sabihin lang zero na ang whole number mo kasi naiba yung whole number dapat sa decimals kaya nga may decimal point all right let's have okay dividing a decimal by a decimal this time parehong decimal ang dalawa pwede mix decimal yung um the divisor or dividend okay so let's try 11.42 divided by 0 0.2 so ang gagawin natin dito is lipat tayo ng isang decimal place dahil wala dapat decimal sa divisor so lipat tayo ng isang place dito okay lipat natin yung um, decimal point natin so dyan na siya at then naglipat ka ng isa dito lipat ka rin ng isa dito Okay, so lipat and then ayan na yung decimal point mo. Kung tutusin, ang ginawa natin dito class is times natin ito with 10 and then times natin ito with 10. So kung natandaan, sabi ko noon, um, lalo na dun sa um, um, equation, yung um, properties of equalities, pag ginawa sa kaliwa, gagawin sa kanan. So in this case, uh, pareho lang din sa uh, division natin. Pag ginawa mo sa divisor, gagawin mo rin sa dividend. So, times 10 dito, times 10 din dito. So, kung nag times 10 ka dito, move lang yan ng isa. Move lang din ng isa. Okay? Kaya, ang explanation dyan, bakit tayo nag-move ng isa is nag-multiply nag tayo ng 10 para maka-move siya ng isa. Okay? So, ang ano natin ngayon, dividend natin ngayon is 114.2 divided by 2 na yan. So, tanggal na dapat ang okay, decimal dyan sa divisor dahil wala nga dapat decimal. So, let's go ahead na. So, start tayo supposed to be with 1. Kaya lang kulang. So, sama na natin yung katabi. So, we start na with 11. So, 11 divided by 2, meron kang 5. 5 ang 2 dyan. Diba? And then, 5 times 2, you have 10. 11 minus 10, that would be 1. Bring down 4. And then 14 divided by 2, that is 7. 7 times 2, that is 14. And then subtract na. 14 minus 14, that is 0. Bring down 2. And then 2 divided by 2, that is 1. 1 times 2, that is 
2. And then, subtract natin. 2 minus 2, that is 0. And then, lagay natin ang decimal point. Sa so, tandaan ha, yung ginawa ko lang is, sinundan ko pa rin yung um, steps natin. So, dad, then mom, sister, brother, and then rover. Balik ulit. So, um, okay, so that is divide ulit and then multiply. Okay, so next. Alright, we have um, 0 0.2. 2115 divided by 15. So, move tayo ngayon ng dalawa. Since dalawa ang decimal places mo dito, we have the tenths and the hundredths. So, since sinabi ko wala dapat decimals in the divisor, so since dalawang decimal place ito, dalawang movement tayo. So, times 100 to 100. So, 100 din dito, times 100 din, move din ang dalawang place. So, isa, dalawa, dito na ang decimal point. And then, isa, dalawa, dito na ang decimal point. Alright? So, this is now 21. Simula tayo with 21 divided by 15. So, that is 1. And then, 1 times 15 is 15. And then, minus tayo, 21 minus 15, that is 6. Bring down 1. So, 61 divided by 15, merong apat. Kasi dalawang 15, 30, di ba? So, apat. So, 4 times 15, that is 60. 61 minus 60, that would be 1. And then, bring down natin yung 5. Okay? And then, 15 divided by 15 na. So, we, meron tayong isa. And then, 1 times 15, you have 15. And then, 15 minus 15, that would be... Zero. And then, huwag kalimutan ang decimal point sa taas. Okay, sa taas dapat yung decimal point. Okay? Right? We will have dividing a whole number by a decimal. So, this time, yung dividend natin ay whole number. Walang decimal yan. Divide natin with a decimal which is 0.2. So, 15 divided by 0.2. Okay. So, uh, ulit, Sabi ko noon, walang decimal place sa divisor dapat. So, move natin ito ng isa. Okay? So, soon since nag-move tayo ng isa dito, dito rin dapat mag-move tayo ng isa. ba So, ang decimal point ng whole number ay nasa gilid lang yan. Yan. Supposed to be, ha? And then, move tayo ng isa. So, dapat lagyan natin ang zero dyan. Okay? And then, i-move natin dito. Diyan na dapat ang decimal point. So, since pareho na silang whole number, pwede na nating tanggalin ang decimal point. Okay? And then, move on na tayo with division. So, simula tayo with 15 kasi kulang yung 1. So, 15 divided by 2, that would be 7. 7 times 2, that is 14. 15 minus 14, that is 1. Bring down 0. Okay, and then ulit, divide ulit, 10 divided by 2, that is 5, and then 5 times 2, that is 10, and then 10 minus 10, that is 0. Now, since wala nang katabi, tapos na yung division natin. So, this is now 75. Pero kung titignan mo lang, 150, hatiin mo, eh di 75 lang, di ba? Kung meron kang 150 na uh, pesos, pera hatiin mo, edi tama lang 75. Okay? And then, let's have another example. Okay, another example tayo. So, 15 decimal, uh, a whole, whole number ulit. 15 divided by 1.25. Now, ngayon, dalawang decimal places na ang imumove natin. So, move natin ito dyan sa gilid. Okay? And then, ito, move din natin. So, dito yung uh, decimal point niya, di ba? Sa gilid. So, um, dagdagan natin ng dalawang uh, zero. Kung tutusin class, para ka lang nag... Um, parang, parang pera lang to eh. Di ba kung pera, uh, pwede mong isulat na 15, uh, 15 lang. Pwede rin 15.00. So, kahit walang 0.00 or may 0.00, pareho lang. Okay lang yan. 
Walang naiba. Okay? So, dito, nilagyan natin ng dalawang zero zero kasi imumove natin yung decimal point. So, dito, imumove din natin dito sa kabila. Ayan. So, namove na silang dalawa. Pareho na sila ngayon na whole number. So, proceed na tayo. So, 150, kasi hindi pwede ang 1, kulang. Kung 15, kulang din kasi 125 to eh. Okay, diretso tayo sa 150. So, we have 150 divided by 125, merong isa. And then, 1 times 125, okay? And then, subtract na tayo. So, 150 minus 125, may sobrang benching ko. Bring down 0. And then repeat, 250 divided by 125, you have 2. Multiply 2 times 125, that is 250. Subtract na tayo. So, this is now 0. No. Bring down sana, kaya lang wala na. So, tapos na tayo. So, sagot natin is just 12. Alright? Okay, so may practice exercise dito. Okay, pwede nyo sagutan. Alright, um, limang numbers lang ito pero uh, wala na akong binigay na uh, sagot. Okay, you may try these five numbers and then follow in follow the steps in doing long division. Okay, sana makuha ng maayos ha. Alright.